Hi, I'm Andrew Armstrong, and when I'm not doing rubbish impressions of Hodor from Game of Thrones, I'm buying things in Poundland. Let me introduce you to my sack of stuff. Here it is. This is a whopping great big sack, and I'll show you why. Because I bought... Yoo-hoo! It's almost an adhesive special because I bought a load of adhesives. In fact, let me show you the one non-adhesive thing first because that's going to be more interesting in one of my later videos. This is one of those electric fly swats. I don't know if you've seen these in your local pound store. I'm sure you have. Or even the sort of local market. They're great. You pop some batteries in here. This is really terribly made, actually. You pop a couple of cells in here. Shut the battery door. I'm not going to put some cells in, actually, frankly, because I'm going to be electrocuting myself if I do. There's a button on the side, you push that, the little red light goes on, which means this layer is activated. And then what happens is, if a fly touches this, bzzz, <laughs> he's gone. Deadly. Right, now for my adhesive bag. So Yoohoo Adhesive, there you go. You've seen this, you've probably used it at school, Sam Yoho. Um, this is basically a general purpose, um, it says, <laughs> cola universal yeah it's a universal cola no no it's a universal adhesive um, it works on lots of things metal plastics rubber shoes all this sort of stuff so that's a good general purpose adhesive to have in your house so for example if you're doing a repair on the sole of your shoe you could use a resin but a resin will get hard and brittle and fall off whereas this it will take longer and be more annoying but you know put some clothes pegs on and this will be a really good job, for, do a really good fix on those shoes. So that's that kind of thing. Something that you'll have to sort of jig up or tape or you know hold temporarily while this cures. But this is actually probably the staple glue you'll have for repairing your kids' plastic toys. And yeah, beware of super glue, by the way. Uh, and speaking of super glue, loads of it. This is um, three grams each and there's eight of those. They do bigger super glue sizes in Poundland. You can buy for the same money, like 60 grams worth, if you get the one in three pots, um, three 30 gram pots. The problem is super glue, you open it, you use two drops, and then the whole tub will go hard. And that's because super glue re reacts to the moisture. Super glue! Super goo, super glue reacts with the moisture in air, and that's why it goes that white powdery stuff. That's why they use it for sort of fingerprints, even. It, that's the thing you see that um, cyano acrylate stuff in the uh, you know uh, CSI, and they put some fingerprint things in a glass, and the misty thing goes. That's super glue. Um, it's really good for certain types of plastic and rubber. It's actually amazingly good on nitrile rubber. Um, I'll show you a use of this later on in one of my videos because I'm going to, I use this for sort of repairing really small delicate plastic things that I need to set quickly but I'm not going to have a whole load of load. So for example imagine the keyboard and it's got the little plastic things on the bottom of a keyboard that hook in, sometimes they snap. You couldn't really use the Yoohoo because it's too flexible, too compliant. Superglue is a bit more brittle but it'll, it'll dry very quickly and good for those sensitive areas. Next, wow, I really really doubled up on this. Two packs of two pack epoxy. So two pack epoxy is basically two tubes and it's called two pack because there's two of them. One is the actual adhesive itself and one is the activator. And when their powers combine, you get a really super strong glue. So this is a great value again, a pound for four tubes and it's probably one of the toughest bonds you've get. It will actually glue again most things. Um, it does glue brittle, so that's something to bear, bear in mind. However, it does cure much quicker than the Yoohoo. So it's about the same curing as the super glue, maybe a bit slower, but definitely about a billion times quicker than the Yoohoo um, or contact adhesive. Really good for anything, actually. Anything where you want a strong bond, I would always recommend epoxy. Just try it out. Um, I'm trying to think of the top of my head something I want to do. For example, I've taken a huge chip out of a counter because I was pulling apart a turbocharger earlier and I kind of slammed a massive mallet and chisel straight through the counter, a kitchen counter, and it's taken a big chip out the corner. It looks really bad. So what I'm going to do for it, I'm going to squirt out two of these tubes into a tub. I'm going to add some black toner from a plinter cartridge, 
a print a printer cartridge a printer cartridge because the counter is black and I'm going to make a black uh, epoxy glue filler and I'm going to scoop that in and it's going to look amazingly good when it's done epoxy is very versatile very handy very very strong indeed ah something else actually non glue the final thing in my bag of fun is craft knives or general utility knives you've got a combination here of utility craft utility craft i or, you know i have stanley knives i have all the proper metal handled one of these but frankly you can't beat having these lying around i use them for taking gaskets off things and just general purpose opening boxes the other ones are great but these are kind of cheap for a pound you get a whole bunch of them they're pretty damn good just be careful when you're using you don't put too much pressure on because the handles will just come apart in your hands and the blades will snap so let's just count it all up one, two, three, four, five, six pounds. Look at that for six, oops, drop one. Six pounds just gets you all of this stuff. So that's what's in my shopping bag today. Did you buy anything good shopping bag in, in Chandra? What's wrong with me today? I can't speak. Did you buy anything in Poundland today yourselves? Please comment down below. Let me know what bargains you came up with and click subscribe. Thanks for watching.